Ooh. Vibes. I'm feeling the vibes. I like this one. What is up YouTube? It is Hollywood Floss, the worst producer of all time, back with another video. In today's video, we're looking at DigiKit's West Coast Grammy 2 VST plug-in we're going to check out today. But before we go any further, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you get any video I upload to the channel. You know, I'm always trying to give you the latest content on reviews, beats, tutorials, live streams. So tap in, hit that like and subscribe button. All right. So today we got DigiKit's west coast grammy 2 um there's a, a, a vst plug in part one but we're gonna skip that we'll go straight to the sauce west coast grammy 2 right now it's on sale for 9.95 i'll put the link in the description if you want to get that pick it up show them some love if you like what you hear if you don't let me know in the comments why or why not you love or you hate the vst so we're back with the new version of our favorite plugin, West Coast Grammy 2. This time we didn't focus on the looks, but the sounds that we care about most. We'll be the judge of that. We return to the hot and sunny West Coast. Hey, California love with the sounds that inspire to create the next heat beat. All right. So 100 new sounds over 13 categories. Let's dive into that. All right. So I got it already popped up. Beautiful looking, you know, VST comes with some 808 bass bells brass flutes guitars keys leads organ synth plug strings and so forth and then the reverb delay chorus flanger stutter effect we'll test it out panner left and right amp envelope the adsr and gain of course glide with so some some pretty cool effects i love this right here just just bright a little shout out to digikids for that that's already a plus so here we're gonna start off with the 808s paco okay not bad not bad you can use that 808 next up prestige That Bay Area, that West Coast DJ Mustard sound with the Prestige. I told, I like those two so far. And you remember, I always say, I always say with the bass and the 808, it's kind of weird because we got one shot. So it's like, eh, do we really need it? Yes or no? It is one of those things. Oh, okay, but that's sticky icky. That's a good one right there. That's a good one. Can't hate on that one, all right? And then bass. We're not going to go to too many of these. That's thunder? Was that thunder? Oh, it's like a bass hit. These hoes are loyal. Right, blue face. We got to check out a blue face. Blue face always in the news. Okay, well, so we're not gonna check up all the bases. You already know what it is when it comes to bass and 808. I feel like there's other ones that we can use, but shout out to them for putting it in there. And this one right here, that's a strong one. I will be using that one. So sticky 808. Okay. Let's go into these bells and I'm gonna uh, pull open some MIDI. All right, that's no good. Time out. That was just chaos right there. I don't know what that one was. I don't know what that one was about. Beans. Let's see if we can correct it with beans. All right, Blanco. Hey. 
Hey, I got lost in the sauce. That's a good one right there. That Blanco. Hey, hey, I'm not mad at you, Blanco. Hey, I like this one. I like that one a lot. Flow. Hope. Might want to add glimp with something. Indigo, okay, like Chris Brownish. Oh, ready, y'all. Let's see if we can fix it. <laughs> so the glide does work. I was just trying to see if it worked. Playboy. So I'm impressed with the bell section. Okay, so we got some potential, okay. We got some potential. We messing with it. Let me change up just a little bit the MIDI so we don't get stagnated. Let's go to the brass envy. I don't know about that one. Okay. Yeah. All right, I don't know about the brass, but the bells was fire. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. The bells was fire. Let's see what else we can do with these. And when we go into the flutes. Okay, I'm not mad at this one. But let me see if I just... I just don't get flute from it. Gotta hold it down on that one. I like that one though. Let's turn it down. That's a no for me on the Kinder toy. Okay, Persian Prince. Maso menos. It's okay. Okay. Now we're going to the guitars. Let's get some new MIDI in there. Let's get some new MIDI in there. Let's go to some. There we go. Let's see what we got.
this one's a little bit thin the first two was kind of full better guitars and we already know for a real guitar you got to use a that real guitar sound is hard to to substitute a synth guitar Okay, I like contact. And this is where you have to use like guitar rig to get a different amp, different sound. Okay, original taste, not bad. Sunset. Okay, so we're working with a little bit of some, like I said, the bells are the standout for me so far, and a couple of those 808s. Other than that, uh, a little bit lackluster on what we really look for, and we're going to buy something, especially if the original price was $80, but for $10, you make the, you make the decision on that one, okay? Keys. Let's see what we got. I like the first one. I don't like this one. Rosé? Okay, I can see that in the background of the track. Ooh. Vibes. I'm feeling the vibes. I like this one. Alright, so looking into these leads, we got Fitter. Okay. Frontman. Impo. Okay, Pink Lambo. Okay, sweet powder, we like that one. Okay, so we alright with the, the leaves, they ain't too hot. I ain't gonna lie to you, they ain't too hot. Slayer. Okay, that's the organ I like. I like that organ. Paradiso. We like that one. Okay, so two out of three ain't bad on the organs. So far, like I say, a couple of guitars. We love the bells. Everything else is it's kind of been forced and not in a good way not in a good way oh crystal
Okay, it's your boy Hollywood Floss. This is DigiKids presents West Coast Grammy Volume 2. Let me know what you think. I'm only really impressed with a couple of 808s, the whole bell section, the whole pad section. Um, let's check out the, the plugs before we get out of here. Okay. Okay. Okay, so the plugs, we're going to add the plugs, the bells, and the pads. You're going to have to decide. You're going to have to decide for yourself. Is nine or ten dollars worth those three categories in a, in a 808? If if it is, then pick it up. If not, then you might want to hold off on this one and let them add some more sounds to it. Some of the sounds just sound a little bit bland. Other VSTs give you more, but for 9.95, are you really losing if you get three categories? So leave in the comments what you think. I'm gonna rate it like four, five out of ten, average range. But you never know. You might you might hear something that I didn't hear, but that's my, my rating on it. Um, Hopefully, they do better next time. It's your boy, Hollywood Floss, the worst producer of all time, signing off. Let me put it back on this one right here and say peace.